<laughs> it looks actually pretty finished in my opinion. Nice. Hello and welcome back to Asset Hub. Well, on my channel, I review mostly finished products, finished cars. I want to have a look at finished mods and the best cars I can recommend to you. Well, what about cars that are still a work in progress? There are a lot of cars that are released but are not finished yet, but they will be finished in the nearby future. Well, let's have a look at a couple of those in this series. Let's start off with this car. This is the 2021 Maserati MC20. It is a gorgeous car. Uh, this mod is produced by Ghost ghost it's like ghost without a h so the ghost anyway it's uh, our link is patreon in the, in the description so okay but from the outside it's a beautiful car it's a gorgeous car in real life and it's a real fun car to drive so what is this car so far well this is the 0 0.1 version so it's when you look at a 0.1 version it's nowhere near for a finished product this car however it looks actually pretty finished in my opinion it's a from the outside it's a gorgeous car actually in real life i think it's a gorgeous car as well and it's just oh it's it's a pretty fun car to drive i thought it was a sports car at first when it was came out because it looks pretty small actually and it has only a twin turbo 3 liter v6 but don't get yourself fooled it produces over 600 horsepower and it's almost 700 newton meters of torque so that is quite impressive actually then 0 to 60 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers per hour actually goes in 2.9 seconds which is insanely quick so that is the whole recipe to a supercar in my opinion then this mod as i said before let's have a look at unfinished products well unfinished don't take it the wrong way there of course are products that are being made right now or mods that are being currently made from the outside as i said before i think from the outside this is pretty well done and finished already however from the inside there is still a lot of work to be done when you look closely to the interior and especially to the gauges when the sun shines into the car you see the light indicators which is quite strange but i would say that's an easy fix anyway and you can't really see the screens maybe it's my setting as i have it now but i did try it in a couple of different other scenarios and it's really hard to see the screen because it's a digital screen it's not a real cluster anymore but it's a complete digital screen and which in real life looks, looks really nice actually not my favorite i prefer the old school clusters the the old school clusters as i said uh, but this one is all digital and it, it does look really pretty actually but you can't actually see it so it's nice that you actually can see the kilometers per hour and the gate uh, gear you are in and of course in the middle you have the infotainment system with the android system with spotify youtube etc and that all works of course then how does it handle well i have to say it already handles pretty well you can easily drift it because it is a real re rear wheel drive of course sorry and um, and if you want to drive it quick you can do it as well then to jump into the sound well the sound it does sounds i would say as in real life because um well let's be honest many people are bitching a little bit about the sound how oh, it wasn't the best driving but many people are a bit disappointed about the sound as this of only a v6 but of course has a v6 as well and i would say of course sounds way better than the comparison i wanted to make but here we are the sound then again it does sound as in real life in my opinion it sounds a bit boring there's just not much going on the only thing which is nice is the 
turbochargers. Yes, it is a twin turbocharged, of course. Well, it is twin turbocharged, of course. And you can hear them actually pretty well. This sound is pretty realistic. Do I enjoy this car so far? As I would recommend cars in my most of my videos. So would I recommend this car? Keep an eye out for this car. Keep an eye out on their progress. I will keep an eye out as well and I will review it again when it's completely finished. When it's the version 1 I will guess. As it is only the 0 0.1 but I would say just try it already. It's actually a pretty fun car to drive. So that's it for this car. I just want to make a quick video about this car. Try it out. I will post all the links in the description. The Ghost, if I say it correct, pretty good job already. As it is a gorgeous car anyway and it is a really fun car to drive. Try it out yourself. Let me know what you think of this car and we'll get back to you when the version 1 is out. Bye.